I know people go around their day and it's like, I wonder what the hell this guy is thinking about me when I'm not in this motherfucking room. Don't. Oh shit, boy. There's just something different about drinking this perspiring glass. Zoom into that. Of nectar. There's something different. I fuck with it. I really do. Dusty. So, what are we gonna talk about today? That's the real question, and I know you wanna know the answer. So let's just get right into it. How you living? How you treating yourself? I need to know it all. I need to know it all. Now, I'm gonna be real honest for a second. I have a dopamine addiction. Should we talk about that today? No. 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 I always knew that I was different. Like, I mean, growing up, yeah, it's okay to be different. To be a little bit more quirkier than the average Joe. As long as you got character, it's okay. I mean, we can't all be normal, after all. I mean, who wants to be normal nowadays, anyways? Who well, has time for that anymore? I do not try to be normal and shit. It's an unattainable goal. Because what is normal nowadays? Jesus, what is normal? Someone tell me. What is normal nowadays? Huh? Can you tell me that? I don't think you can. I don't think you can. I don't think you can. Well, it ain't me. That's all I know. And I've come to terms with that. You know, I've been weird at times. Okay. It's all good. Socially awkward. Introverted. The thing with me is, you know, growing up, I was super quiet. Super really quiet. Like you wouldn't hear a peep out of me unless I'm actually vibing with you. I would be afraid to step outside of my shell because I was afraid of judgment. That was, I could tell you right now, that's where that shyness came from. And that's honesty, you see that? You see what I'm doing right here? I'm telling you something that you probably didn't know about me. I was a shy dude. I am a shy dude. When it comes to, well, it always depends on the vibe, the influence, if I had a drink. It always depends. It depends on the people I'm around as well. Always depends on the people I'm around. Different sides of mojo come out depending on who or what I'm around. Yeah. And over the years, I've adapted. And I've changed so many times. I remember starting out, a lot of people told me, you know, just be yourself. 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 Tell me. Which self are you talking about exactly? Which one? Cause I got many. God help us out. You better be focused on me, motherfucker. I swear. You know, I'm a very complex individual to deal with. I'm surprised my girl deals with me. She hates me half the time. But that's what it is. I think all you have to realize all complex bro. i'm up i'm down i'm left i'm right i'm all over the place half the time i ain't perfect fuck me <laughs> there's a lot of things that come with me she doesn't hate me she just dislikes me sometimes but um yeah Let's get right into it and uh, let's get down to breast. Man. You know what? When I was little, I think that's why my brain is wired the way it is. Because I didn't listen to like, yo, artists like Nelly and Busta. All of them. Remember to touch it, bring it. Yo, that was going dumb. Like, okay, for instance, when I was in grade, grade six, if you listen to my little mp3 thing that i had back then like the little shit like with the one battery inside yeah that was my first like audio device if you listen to that almost all of them were movie soundtracks and every time i would watch a movie i would put it in my little mp3 
I would take that. I would I would try to find that. And you know, these times now, I don't think there was all that like Shazam. No, talk about BBM time. There's no Shazam. When how long has Shazam been? How, how long has Shazam been? Crickets. Crickets. What the f <laughs> But yeah, there was no Shazam. So I would have to figure out a way to find out what song that was. So I'll end up like searching it on Google or something. I totally forgot. Oh wait, I remember how I used to get the tracks. No way I was paying for any iTunes or any fuckery. Let's see with an MP3. What the fuck going on? I would use LimeWire. Who remembers that? The LimeWire was the shit. For a lot of reasons. Some of y'all know what I'm talking about. I don't know. I listen to a whole bunch of shit. The ET soundtrack was the one big thing I would listen to a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. When I first watched ET, it was just like bam, bam. Diving into my awakening, I actually realized that it's not an uncommon thing to look up at the stars and feel homesick. Like, you ever get this feeling and you know apparently it's like a big thing around the spiritual community people just start waking up and they start realizing that maybe i wasn't actually from here in the first place you get what the hell i'm saying you know what i'm not gonna get into that uh, maybe you just like if i even put out a video about like oh i actually think i'm an alien i think I think I'm probably gonna lose like half of my subscribers and I probably have like 20 right now. So it's like, what the fuck? I'm not gonna do that. Or maybe I should. Maybe I should. Maybe I should just say fuck it. Yeah, uh, maybe I should just wait till October. I feel like, I feel like October is a better time to come out the closet as a extraterrestrial. <laughs> but yeah. I just, uh, I just want everyone to understand that it is okay to be weird or different. It is okay. It's definitely 100% okay in my eyes. And especially when it comes to Neon Ecstasy, we promote that shit. Outcasts, underdogs, the geeks, the nerds, the stoners, the black sheep of the families. I fuck with every single one of y'all. Hey, if y'all sipping something, cheers me right now to being different. Because that is what it's all about. It's okay. It's okay. It is a okay, baby. Yo, there's just something about sipping out of a tanker that just gets me, right? It just gets me really going. Raise your tankards to me. I swear to God, I'm gonna make it a movement. I want everyone to go buy a tankard right now. They're on fucking Amazon, let's go. Everyone to fucking buy a tankard for the month of fall. The month of fall. <laughs> the month of October. Get right now and just keep on using it until October's finished. Actually, you can still use this in Christmas. Keep on using it the rest of the year. Keep on using the rest of the year. It's just different. It's just different. So yeah, I really want to see more of this on Earth. Stop worrying about what people will think if you show your true colors. Stop worrying about what people will think if you talk a certain way. Or you act a certain way, you walk a certain way. These things don't define you as a human being. I hope you understand that. Humans have so many layers. How can I define someone by how they talk or how they walk or how they dress or the color of their skin? What the fuck is that? Pardon my language. So yeah, I really need to make sure that everybody is embracing all of themselves. What if I don't like myself? What if I don't like what I see in the mirror? Every blood clot shade, every part, hmm? every single part, even the parts that you tuck away deep inside and only show them the light of day when you're alone in a room. Hmm? That is what I'm talking about. That part of yourself that you keep for only yourself. 
I want you to love that part. And I want you to let that part out and breathe a little bit. Let that part breathe, motherfucker. <laughs> let it breathe. Everyone has their own little unique bit. You know what I'm saying? Embrace the uniqueness that you were given. You were unlike any other. You dig? I fuck with it. Heavy. Because it's your je ne sais quoi. You dig what I'm saying? It's your power. You dig what I'm saying? It's your gift. And you know what? If anyone's gonna tell you you ain't worthy or you ain't worth it because you're different, you're a flaw, you're, you're je ne sais quoi. Yo, fuck him. That's it. Fuck him. That's all I can really say. That's it. Don't be worrying about anybody else. Hey, I just read something the other day. It's like, it goes something like this. I think it goes something like this. I'm paraphrasing. Don't attack me and kill me on the cross. It is not my responsibility to know what you think about me. It is not my burden to know what you think about me. It's not my business, basically, what I'm saying. Again, all of this is paraphrasing. I totally forgot what it said, and I'm just legit going out the door. But that's basically what it is. Hey, hey. It's okay. Hey, that's all I got to say. It's okay. It's not my business, right? And it ain't your business. That's for them to know, for them to think. I know when people go around their day and it's like, I wonder what the hell this guy is thinking about me when I'm not in this motherfucking room. Don't, because it's not your business. That's when your brain goes over time. You see, you want peace, you want the peace, but you're not ready to work for the peace. To work for the peace, you have to let these things go. You have to let them go. You have to let them be free and fly away. What are you doing today? <laughs> what you doing today? You letting them go away? Huh? Are you keeping them inside? Don't keep them inside. So that's the number one takeaway. You're different. Right? How could you really be like, I'm so alone because I'm different. Or I'm so alone because no one understands me. Let me tell you this. Everybody is different, so you're not alone. Not a lot of people can connect, that's the problem. So we disconnect because we fear that no one will understand. And it's right, there's a lot of people that won't. One thing we can all have in common, and that's the number one common ground here, is that we are all human. Maybe, the results aren't in yet. <laughs> the results aren't in yet. That's the number one common ground. If not, we're all human, we're all different. We shouldn't segregate because we are different. Does that make any sense? We're different, so let's just fuck right off. Go elsewhere. Nobody's the same. Different. Why is there even a divide? Am I lying? I'm not lying. I can only speak. What's real? What the hell?